Comparative Analysis of Magnetic Field versus Magnetic Induction Magnetic induction is also known as magnetic flux density. The literal meaning of induction stands for force. The process of magnetic induction happens due to a magnetic field. The table below gives you both similarities and differences of magnetic field versus magnetic induction. Magnetic field magnetic induction The magnetic field is a region around the magnetic material or moving charges in which magnetism exists. Magnetic induction is a phenomenon of the production of electric current or magnetization of material by means of the magnetic field. Only the moving charges have the ability to generate the magnetic field. The process of magnetic induction is done by the application of an external magnetic field to magnetize the object. The magnetic field always travels in such a direction perpendicular to the electric field. Magnetic induction is due to a change in the magnetic field moving in space, producing an electric current in the opposite direction. The motion of the charges in the uniform magnetic field traces the Lorentz force law. The magnetic induction predicts the force acting on the charges and follows the Lorentz laws. The sources of magnetic fields are permanent magnets, ferromagnetic material, like iron, which is easily magnetized, and moving electric charges. The sources of magnetic induction are permanent magnets, electric current, and time-dependent electric field. Also, the combination of these three sources together yields magnetic induction. The magnetic field highly depends on the size of the magnets. A longer magnetic can generate more magnetic fields. Magnetic induction also depends on the size of the magnet, as the generation of voltage depends on the magnetic field. If the magnetic field is more, greater will be the flux density, and consequently, magnetic induction will be high. Magnetic fields are represented by equally spaced straight parallel lines. Magnetic induction represents the generation of the magnetic field in the magnetizable material. A permanent magnetic field has the ability to magnetize a magnetizable substance. Magnetic induction has the ability to generate a permanent or temporary magnetic field on the material through magnetization. Comparative table, facts to be remembered. Both magnetic field and magnetic induction are represented by the letter B. The reason is the generation of a magnetic field is due to the induction process. The induced magnetic moment generates the magnetic field. Just like the gravitational field at every point near the Earth, the magnetic field is also there around any magnet or any current-carrying conductor. Magnetic induction is nothing but one of the magnetic field vectors. This can also be represented by the induction line, just like the lines of force. These lines depict the graphical representation of the magnetic induction around the magnet. The direction of B is given by the tangent at the point on the field, and its magnitude is given by the number of lines present per unit area. For the process of magnetic induction, an oscillating magnetic field is required. It produces an electromotive force EMF, across the electrical conductors. The current induced by the process of magnetic induction within the changing magnetic fields generate the current called as eddy current. The eddy currents are produced either due to a conductor moving through the steady magnetic field or a stationary conductor in an oscillating magnetic field. When the paramagnetic material and ferromagnetic material are magnetized by the external magnetic field, the magnetic fields are generated parallel to the external field. The magnetization of diamagnetic material by means of external magnetic material produces a weak magnetic field, which is antiparallel to the external magnetic field. Frequently Asked Questions What is meant by magnetic induction? Magnetic induction is a phenomenon of magnetizing a material by the application of an external magnetic field. Magnetic induction involves a process in which an ordinary iron or steel acquires the magnetic property by placing them close to the permanent magnets. The magnetic field radiated from the poles of the magnet induces the magnetic field. Are magnetic induction and electromagnetic induction the same? In some contexts, magnetic induction is regarded as electromagnetic induction because both are done by means of a magnetic field though they are different from one another. 
Magnetic induction may or may not produce permanent magnets. Meanwhile, electromagnetic induction uses the electric current to oppose the change in the magnetic field. Magnetic induction requires only magnets and magnetizable substances, while electromagnetic induction requires magnets and electric circuits. How to induce magnetism from an external magnetic field? When an unmagnetized material is placed near the external magnetic field, the material acquires the magnetic field, this is called induced magnetism. When you place an iron close to the permanent magnets, it attracts the iron, thus, the magnetic field is developed in the iron. So the iron piece now behaves as a magnet, and it also attracts other materials towards itself. The induced magnets can only attract the material until they are under the influence of an external magnetic field. They cannot repel material. Why does diamagnetic material produce magnetic antiparallel to the external field? The generation of the magnetic field is concerned with the electrons in the outer shell of the orbit and associated with the spin. In a diamagnetic material, the outer shell consists of paired electrons, and thus their spin will be zero. So there will be no net magnetic moment. Thus, the magnetic field produced from the diamagnetic materials is extremely small and is antiparallel to the external field, causing negative magnetization. What happens to the induced magnets when the external magnetic fields are removed? The induced magnets lose most of the magnetic property or sometimes lose the entire magnetic property when the external magnetic fields are removed. Induced magnets are referred to as magnets produced due to the application of an external magnetic field. The magnetized material attains magnetic behavior as long as they are in contact with the external field. Once the magnetic fields are removed, they may lose the magnetism, and they again become unmagnetized material. Please visit our website lambdageeks.com for more articles on technology, engineering, mathematics, and various other domains. scientific calculator and many more other tools.